guys are pretty excited for today. Why don't you stop spinning? <laughs> Here is your card. I've been needing one of these. Look how much you have in your account. <laughs> That's a lot of money. Holy, what am I teaching my children? <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to Not Enough Nelsons. Today I have decided that I need to teach my kids a little bit more about finances and budget. So I have 10 kids at home and there are a lot of things that I feel like I could have prepared my older six for with just like savings and, and all the goo. Anyway, today I am going to sit and have a talk with them and we are going to give them some new tools to be able to make better financial decisions and save money, etc. So, gathering all the kids. Also, thank you Go Henry by Acorns for sponsoring this portion of my video. Okay. All right, kids. I have a question for you. What? What? How excited would you be to know that one of these Go Henry cars is yours? Shut up! Why? Why on earth would I give my 8-year-old almost sorry, 9, almost 9, a debit card? Here's why. I have my own debit card, and so they feel like there's kind of unlimited funds there. It's used at four seconds a day. Yeah, pretty much. So I feel like for them to really get a full grasp of money and actually having their own money and saving it and spending it wisely, I feel like they have to have it linked to their own account that their allowance goes into. Hello, why didn't I think of this before? Way easier to teach them when it comes to their own money to save it than to yours, right? Because they see it dwindling in their account and they know like, oh, I'm gonna run out of money. I won't be able to go to the movies this weekend if I buy this Sephora whole cart. I'd rather buy the Sephora than go to the All right, yeah, so she'd rather buy Sephora than a movie, but then I'm letting her choose what she does with her own money, which that just feels right to me. Does that not feel right to you guys? It feels right to you. Yeah. So I love these Go Henry cards. They're able to have their very own account linked to it. I'm able to deposit money into their account on payday when they get their allowance. Then they are able to make wise spending choices. We're also going to make sure they put a portion into their savings account so they can see their savings account grow and have the joy of seeing that grow. That's a huge thing too. So. Super excited to give these to each of them. Go Henry debit cards are easy to use and they have great security. Also, you're able to set spending limits for each child to be able to guide their journey with real-time notifications and spend maps. What I love is you can turn on or off the ability to use ATMs or online purchases. And what I really love is I can set daily spending limits so that I can make sure that my kids are making wise purchases, especially like, you know, it's hard not to overspend when you're at a store. So I can be like, hey, only send the hundred dollars at Sephora. <laughs> well, that's impossible. Okay. Oh, it's gonna, that's like two products. That's a lot. <laughs> this is gonna like be so much product. fun. I am so excited. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to visit each one of them in their room. I'm going to tell them how much they have in their savings, how much they saved over the last couple of years. A lot of them don't even know what that is. And so I'm going to let them know what that is, which will be so exciting for them. And then I'm going to give them their card and set their budget, tell them about their allowance, and encourage them how much to put in savings, etc. Are you guys ready for that? Yeah! yeah! Not so. All right, everyone go to your room and I will meet you there. And one thing that I know they're gonna love is I was able to customize each one of their Go Henry cards to give it that little personal touch. All right guys, I'm gonna hit Presley's room first. These guys are pretty excited for today. They've been looking what? forward to it for weeks actually. All right, so Presley. Here is your card, madame. <gasps> it's so cute! Don't I you love, love it? it. Here is the rules with the card. What I love, again, I can set spending limits for yeah. every day, but I want you to have that limit. Like, you know, you're responsible for that limit. I don't want you to hit that limit. I want you to go under the limit every day, okay? So your daily spending limit, unless you cleared it with me, is $20. But what? If you cleared it, yeah, I know, it's so exciting. All right, but if you cleared it with me, like if you've saved and haven't spent the $20 for like a couple weeks and you want to do like a big buying spree and clear it with me first. What about food? Say I wanted to go get like my favorite fast food, mm -hmm. would you pay or would we not pay? So if I am buying dinner for our whole family, of course I will pay. I would be like, is it worth it to you to pay for it? If you're paying for it with your own money, Sometimes it's a little less appealing, isn't it? Sometimes I'm like, sure, you can buy whatever you want from here as long as it comes out of your checking account. And then they're like, uh, never mind. I don't need all of it. Just one item is fine, right? Yeah. Feels a little bit different coming from mom. So this is gonna teach you how to be responsible for your own money. Okay. What's super fun is I'm going to be putting pretty good amount of money in there every single week. And so you will have the ability to put a big portion into savings and to spend up to $20 a day. Now listen, that $20 a day, you need to save it. You need to not spend it every single day because that actually is going to pay for all of your makeup, 
all of your skincare, all of your fun hair stuff, any fun clothes that you want outside of what I buy you normally for birthdays and Christmas yeah. and back to school, right? Stuff like that. So any fun things and then hanging out with friends on the weekends, it's gonna pay for all of it. So I wouldn't suggest every day you spend the $20. I would save it to be able to buy things like once a month, I wanna buy an outfit, that's gonna take like that whole week's budget. Does that make sense? Yeah. So we're gonna see how this budget goes. I know it sounds like a lot, but really over a week, $120, if it includes even birthday presents for friends or you know, just any of those kind of things, yeah. it's gonna add up quick. And what's so fun is if you have money left over and savings at the end of every week, it goes into your savings and then you're able to like build up and see that. In fact, on that note, do you wanna know how much is in your savings right yes. now? Yes. Am I gonna be able to check what I have in my on my phone? Yes, in oh, fact, wait. you can download the Go Henry app on your phone. I'll do that right now. I yes, and then you're able to keep track of all of that as well. Presley, you're gonna tie. Do you wanna know how much money is in your account right now? <laughs> <laughs> it's because you've done so well. You've worked so hard this <laughs> last couple years and that is your amount. Now listen, yeah. I know that looks like a ton, but how many oh. years until you turn 16? Five. Five, yeah. So five years. It's the year right now. So here, here's the thing. If you saved that much, yeah. like from here on out, maybe every year you could save that much. Like if you mm -hmm. could really work hard and even add a lot more to that, you'd be able to pay for a really nice car. Yeah, like that's Lily did. Lily saved a ton of her money and she was able to pay for a really nice car. Facts. So even though it looks like a ton, you're like, oh my heck, I can just spend all the money I want at my favorite makeup store. You might want to save it for a car. Because I usually just match what you spend on the car. Yeah. So whatever you're going to spend on the car, I'm going to match it. And that's a nice car, right? Ooh, so you're Henry. downloading it right now? Yeah. Go Henry. So I have all of the kids on my app and I can go through and deposit money from my app. But from their app, they're able to see what they're spending what their balances is on their own account. Yeah. Guys, I'm gonna get Presley all logged into her Go Henry app and then I'm gonna head on to the next kiddo. All right, Elsie. I'm on my way. Hey, Elsie. All right. I'll Hi. come around your bed here so I don't put my feet on your bed. Are you excited to get your card? Yeah. Elsie has been one of the most excited of everybody. I'm not sure why. I actually introduced my mom to Go Henry. Yes, she is actually the one that came up to me and was like, Mom, have you heard about Go Henry? And I was like, tell me about it. And she told me all about it, showed me all of, you know, the app and everything. Yeah. And yeah, she is the reason why we're even using Go Henry. But I love the idea. I was trying to figure out how to do it and how to better. I don't know, because I had my kids' traditional debit cards and it just was a little bit harder to control and I didn't want them to be able to get on the actual bank and this is just much more secure to me. Much more parent and kid friendly. All right, so your card. Besides that, you got to make a cute card, hi. How cute is that? There's a little ice cream there. We won't show you all the numbers. You have a daily allowance of $20. And I know that yeah. sounds like a ton, but that has to pay for and add up to pay for everything that you buy. So like, you know, what if you don't for five days use the $20 budget? What is 20 times five? 20, 40, 60, wait, 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 $80. Yeah. $100. Yes, $100, right? So your monthly budget is right around $480. But oh. that has to pay for everything. I'm talking like if you want to take a stop at the soda shop or if you want to buy your friend a birthday present or if you want to get a new cute outfit because spring is around the corner or you want a new pair of shoes or you want to take a trip to the makeup store and spend way too much money at the makeup store. Hey, that I'm all comes out of your own budget. And listen to this. If you are able to save about half of that every single month, it adds up to a ton in your savings. Do you want to see what your savings account is right now? Yes. You want to see your balance? Yes. All right. You're going to die. Look how much you have in your account. Oh my gosh. That's that a, is lot. a lot. I know it looks like a ton, just like I warned Presley. You have to think about this. In about five or six years, you're going to want to buy a car. So if you keep saving that much, Every year up till your car, you're gonna be able to buy a super cute car. And I match your money for a car, so that's also helpful. Do you know what kind of car I want? What? The same car as Lily. Keep saving that much and you will be on the road to being on the road. I didn't even mean to do that, but that was a really good pun. <laughs> All right, also, Elsie, I am going to let you download the Go Henry app on your phone. Oh, don't worry, I already have it downloaded. You just need to sign into it. See, seriously, this girl, she is on it. I am so proud of you, Elsie, for, you know, Thanks. you were the one who instigated this whole entire, you know, financial yeah. stability, now responsibility. Now everybody's happy that they have their own money. Yes. And 
you're probably happy that we don't have to spend your money. Exactly. <laughs> it's much less burdensome on the mom to know that you have your own budget and you're spending your own money and I don't have to constantly be like, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. This is what it's going to teach you. Say at the end of the week, you are all out of money, but you realize that there is a big sale at your favorite makeup store. Guess what? You don't get to ask mom for more money because you're out of money. Oh no! You just have to wait till the next week and budget more carefully to be able to have more funds. Wait, money. but I have a question. If yes. I have $480 a month mm -hmm. in my bank, if I don't spend any of it, that all then, goes into savings. And you will be like super I, rich in your or savings. Or can I put it all on my card? Um, yeah, but you know what? We need to try to save. I'm hoping that you guys can save at least half of that money every single month. That's my goal. Oh, so I can like spend $200? Yeah, that would be the best goal. Bet. It sounds like a lot, but you still are going to have to budget. You're really going to have to think, do I really want this or do I want to save my money for something different? If I really want to buy something, do I want it or do I need it? Well spoken. All right. Good luck on your financial endeavors. Thanks. Hey. Hey. Are you excited to get your car? Yes. I kept it simple, black, like a cool kid. I've been needing one of these. You have a daily budget, okay? The budget is $20 a day. That equals $480 a month, roughly. But you need to spend it very, very wisely because that money needs to last you the entire month. If you can try to have a goal to put at least half of it in savings, that would be awesome. Are you gonna give me like different types of budgets like during the day or like at any other store? Like a or spending yeah. limit or certain stores? Not right now, I think I'm gonna let it be up to you. Just kind of give you that free agency to budget and spend as you want, unless there's a problem, of course, and then I'll put a limit on different things. But I think that you got this because you've been saving yeah, a ton I don't, of money. I don't spend money yeah, much. you like to save money, which is awesome. Do you wanna see how much money you have in savings right now? Yeah. Boom. That was way more than last time. Yeah, you've been saving really, really good. Proud of you. Thanks. All right, on to the next kiddo. Hello, Miss Navy. Hi. Hi, where do you want to sit to go over your budgeting? Um, Probably on my bed. So have you downloaded the Go Henry app yet? Okay, so go ahead and start downloading that while we talk. Okay. So this is your card. Look how cute Navy's card is. This is your card. It's just like a normal debit card. Um, you will create your own pin. You will have your own app, so you'll be able to say exactly how much money is on there, how much you spent, what your budget is. This is now your allowance, but it's going on the car. Your daily allowance is $20. That adds up to $480 a month. And for that, you need to have that for everything that you spend extra money on. Now, if I pay for dinner, you don't have to pay for your own dinner. But if you yourself go with like a friend mm -hmm. to go get some fun treat or whatever, you'll pay for that on your own. Right? You're gonna go to the movies, you'll pay for it on your own. You're gonna go to golf, pay for your own. The goal is, is for you to save about half of that every single month. So try to save $200 a month. Do you wanna see how much is in savings that you've been saving? Sure. All right, here we go. This is how much you have in savings. Wait, wow, <laughs> that's more than I thought I had. Yes, you are already 16. You're going to get your car really, really soon. And you know the deal with it, right? I double whatever <laughs> you have saved for your car. Yep, yes. So this will help you buy a car, which is awesome. So I would just really try hard to think about every purchase that you make to make this add up to what kind of car you wanna get, right? To make a good budget. Do you have any other questions? Yes, I have one question. Okay. <laughs> Do you really think I'm gonna go golfing? Oh. <laughs> All right, not golfing, but I mean like, you know, like where you hit the ball and, I don't know, anyway, you know what I mean. You have to pay for all your fun. Got it? Get it? Yep. Good. Hey! Sadie, here is your card. Ooh, this is cute. Isn't that so cute? So a little bit about budget. Our audience has already heard, so I'll talk to you a little bit more off camera about budget, but your daily budget's $20. It's $480 a month is what it ends up oh, being, that's a lot. generally. But it sounds like a ton, but I want you to put half of it in savings if possible. It and I'm gonna be an adult money. in less than two years, so yes. I need money. Hello, I like money. Time to start saving. All right, speaking of that, this is the balance in your account right now. Savings wise? Yes. Oh, I need to stop spending <laughs> Do you not feel like you it's, have as much as no, you wish that you had? No, I get I get that it's a lot of money, but I definitely have spent, made more, but I've spent, spent a lot a of it. a little bit of money. So yeah, when you're like really tempted to overspend, think, mm, do I wanna put this in savings or do I really need this? 
or is it more of a want that I can wait for? Ask for it for yeah. my birthday or for Christmas. That's really true. That's really true. Yeah. This is actually really smart. It like actually really helps budget. It really does. Like I'm actually probably going to be really good with my money now. Yeah. Because there's a difference between want and needs and this is the definition of helping. Yes, this will definitely help. It's really good that you have two years to figure out how to budget and how to save because the fear that you're feeling now, like the, the kind of like the weight on your shoulder, like, oh, I, I'm going to have to start budgeting. That, when you move out of the house, is like times 10. I could not agree more. It's better now to realize the responsibility versus wait until then and then suddenly all that comes crashing down on your shoulders. Yeah, so. that's really true. Smart. So you'll do fine. Start I'll never saving. lose this. It's very bright. Yes. Start saving. Sometimes when Sadie goes out with friends, she's tempted to just pay for the whole bill. I'm, I say it's nice, but it's always my mom's money, so it's technically not me being nice, it's my mom's <laughs> nice. Yeah, and I'm not that nice. I'm not paying for the bill every time. So this yeah. time you're gonna be like, oh, I don't wanna Dances. pay for the whole bill. Oh, dancers. dancers. Yeah, if you have a dance coming up, think, oh, I'm gonna spend two or 300, so this month I'm only gonna spend 100 on like. What about dresses? Oh no, I always buy the dress. Okay. But as far as like the extra stuff that you decide to do at a dance, that would be on you. Okay. Any other questions? Um, what about nails? Cause these are the things that I get done like monthly. Yep, that would be up to you to pay for. Um, how about we also do a little discussion and see on the <laughs> investment levels of what we can negotiate. No investment here in the nails, sorry. <laughs> I've invested in my own nails. We all got our own budget for beauty people. What about toes? <laughs> <laughs> That's where you can use the salon and paint your own toes. Woo! That's what I used to do. After I walked uphill both ways to school, I came home and painted my own toes. So oh, one of those stories. Yeah, exactly. We walked through the trenches of school. Yeah. All right, on to the next teenager. Paisley Jane, can I come in? Um, she's closing her closet. In your messes. All right, have a seat, child. Paisley, your card is super cute. It is purple. purple. Love it. Go Paisley. Go Paisley. All right, so budget, 20 bucks a day. That needs to last the Only. whole. Yeah, exactly. The $20 a day adds up to $480 a month and that needs to last you the whole month. That needs to include any makeup products, any skincare, any hair care, any eating out with friends, any going to movies with friends. So, do you want to see how much is in your savings account? Yes. All right. <gasps> savings. Has that much money. Savings is very important. Yeah, that's a lot of money. Holy crap. You've saved a ton of money. Um, probably because I haven't realized that you're connected to my card for food delivery. Um, but I'll be disconnecting that. But that's a lot of money to have saved. But listen, I know it looks like a ton, but in a few years, you're gonna have to buy a card. I'm gonna double your money that you put towards your card. But if you want a really nice card, keep saving like that and you'll be able to get a really nice card when you turn 16, which is super So is that already on my card? So this is your savings. Oh. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put uh, your monthly budget on this card. So I'm gonna put $480 on the card and it needs to last you for an entire month. Okay. That means if the last week your mom, I'm down to zero dollars and I really wanna go hang out with my friends and we're gonna go to a movie, can I borrow? I'm gonna be like, no, I'm sorry. And I'm not gonna give in. Because you need to learn budgeting now so that when you're older, you don't have hey, big budget. When I'm issues. older, I could get a loan. Did you really just say that? Exactly what I don't want you to do. To get a loan to go to the you movies? You don't need a loan for anything if you save, right? So, no more spending, more savings. Keep your savings. I mean, that's growing fast. Right? Yeah. But it has been really easy for you to spend my money and now you're gonna be spending your money. So I think you're going to make a lot different decisions. Every time I go to a makeup store or something, mm -hmm. my mom always takes out a big buck of my money. And then I realize I can't get that much makeup anymore. Yeah, you're like, I don't, so I then, don't really do that much. So then I just kind of stopped getting that much makeup, which is smart. But then you bring me to the makeup store again and I bought more stuff. No more makeup store trips. No more makeup store Actually, trips. Actually, yes, just less money. Because okay. I have a card and I have sure. a budget now. Because it's a lot more scary when you're on your own money, your own money. than your parents' money. Because yeah. it's a lot easier to spend more. And I'm going to have to be, and I know it's so hard for me because I give it all the time. I have to be super firm when I say no. Nope, I your think budget you're going to give it. I think you're going to give it. I think you are. Then if you say no, I'll just go to dad. What am I teaching my children? <laughs> oh, I'm going to have a good discussion with dad. He's going to be, oh, oh dad's no. way more into this than me. Are you kidding? Dad will be like, no yeah, way. whenever I ask. Let's sit down and have a talk about budgeting. Whenever budgeting. I ask dad for money, he goes, ask mom, and then you can get some money for my thing. 
Oh, because dad has a secret stash. Yeah. You also owe me a couple bucks too, because mm. whenever you say oh. you're gonna put my money in yeah. safekeeping, you always steal it and use oh. it and never give it back. Oh, you mean your cash? Yeah. Your cash? Okay. Yeah. So here I'm on the DoorDash app. Oh. Oh. You spent that yesterday. All right. Bye. Love you. Boom. All right. I am sitting here with Mr. B. Mr. B. I present you your Go Henry debit card. Uh, football. Football on it, and your name, dude. How much money does it have? Okay, so listen, do you wanna hear your daily budget? Yes. Your daily budget is the same as everybody else. It's $20 every day. Do you know how much money that is? That's a lot of money. But Beckham, this is my challenge to you because how old are you again? Almost nine. Yes, you're almost nine. February 26th. So I bet you, if you save $300 a month every single month until you're 16, you're gonna be able to get yourself whatever car you want, probably. Ooh. Like a really nice car. Do you want me to show you how much is already in yes. your savings account? What? That's a lot of money, huh? That's crazy! So if you keep saving money like that, you are going to just be super financially strong. So are you gonna do a good job saving your money? Mm -hmm. Budgeting your money? Even for those fun trips you go with your friends, you have to use your own money. You can't use our money anymore, all right? When you take those little trips to the snack shop and you know where, you have to use your own money. Okay. All right, all right, give me your rocks. Last but definitely not least, it's Delaney June. Delaney, are you ready to see your card? Yes. The design. Meta. That is cool. The basketball is cool. Woo woo! It's right up Delaney's alley. Delaney, you have a budget, a daily budget of $20. You're gonna have to save for your own pair of shoes three weeks to pay for it. Okay? <gasps> Those Adidas that I want. Yeah. Start saving your moolah and you'll be able to buy them yourself because guess what? Mom, I'll buy you stuff like obviously at Christmas and your birthday and back to school you'll get all that kind of stuff. And like, you know, when I'm buying everybody things, yes but like the special things that you want. Like no one else got a pair of shoes except for you. And so we need to make sure that on those kind of purchases, it's you paying for it, okay? So you're gonna wanna budget. Also, you are gonna want to put money in savings. I promise you that because you're gonna be 16 before you know it, honestly. And you are gonna want a car. And I match the money that you have in savings for your car, okay? So you are gonna want to save. Do you wanna see how much money you have in savings right now? I've yes. been showing all of the kids how much they have in savings right now. Some are super excited and impressed. Others are a little bit sad of their spending because they really spent spend a lot money. of the money. Yeah. Holy crap. That's a lot of money. And partly is because I haven't been taking your money out of your account when I say I'm going to. I'm like, yeah, you pay that on your own, I'll take it out. But I haven't been the best at that. So I'm going to do better to help you learn how to budget. Like I know that's Ooh. not good news to you, but it really is because it's going to help you budget your money better and you'll have better spending skills when you're out on your own being an adult. So yeah? yeah. All right, so make sure you download Go Henry app on your phone so that you can see how much money you have, so you know that when you go up to pay for something, you're not gonna be out of money and just keep tabs of that balance and yeah, good luck. It's $20 per you. day, right? $20 per day. And if at the end of the month you've run out of money, you can't come to me like, Mom, really, please, I have a birthday party and I need to buy a present. I'm gonna be like, oh man, you might need to give her those pair of shoes that you bought. Oh, on the wall. Yeah, exactly. Nope. All right, do you have any other questions for me? No. None? Yep. All yeah. right. Well, then make sure you check out the link in the description or go to gohenry.com slash Nelson to get your free month of Go Henry today. Bye. Bye. Guys, I know I spend the whole weekly budget on makeup, but it's fine. I don't have anything else going on this week. Hey Preston, do you wanna go to the movies with the rock squad? Are you kidding me?